Crane. Why did we come here? She's stupid! Ready, you're too weak! Ready, you're too weak! You should not have come here, child. Well, we did, so... up everyone and welcome to Senua Saga Hellblade 2. Um, I'm a big fan of the first one. I played through it multiple times. I really enjoyed it. I really liked how they mixed uh, you know uh, Norse mythology and with what they based the game around um, especially with mental health aspect is and uh, I felt like it would be really cool to play through together. So uh, without further ado let's get into it. Senua, the outcast who became a warrior, who faced her demons and challenged the gods for her lover's soul, has accepted the voices, the furies, as part of herself. And nice little uh, recap. Just like her mother Galena, she was not like other people. She saw and heard the world differently. Her father, Zinbel, told her she was evil, tainted by the sin of her mother. Oh, boy. Tormented and afraid, she retreated from the world. Until love broke through like the rays of a new dawn. In Dillion's acceptance, she could live again. He gave light to her mind and freed a warrior from her body. It's beautiful. But the voice of her father stayed with her, reminding her of her curse. And when the plague came to her land, the people blamed Senua. Of course they did. She took her darkness with her. Banishing herself to the wilds. So she was not there when the Northmen massacred her people and sacrificed Dillion to the god of hell. Yep. Senua's torment was so deep that the world around her fell away. She took the head of her beloved, the vessel of his soul, and vowed to go to hell herself to save him. Through mist-shrouded horrors, she fought to find the secret path that would lead her to the very gates of hell. But the way was marked by fire and illusion. Senua had to fight the gods that guarded these paths and stave off the rot which threatened to consume her mind and end her life. Only conquest could open the gates. Only blood would bring her face to face with Hela. Mm -hmm. Face to face with defeat. Once again, Senua was engulfed in darkness, lost in a maze of misery and confusion until Dillion's voice led her to the promise of victory. A sword that could kill a god. To win the sword, Senua would drown in her darkest memories, pulling at the shards lodged in flesh, mind and soul. She pressed deeper into the underworld, 
resisting its grasping hands and deafening cries until she found her prize before the guardian of hell's gates. Senua released her rage, a fury that could not be stopped, not by savage jaws, not by waves of warriors, not by the pull of death itself. This is such an awesome recap. I love the iconography. And desperation, Senua begged for her beloved's release. But a sacrifice must be made, and burdens cast away. Senua's fate was never in the hands of the gods, but in her own. Damn straight. Only she could choose. Oh, it's on a runestone. That's awesome. To live. To go on. And to take us with her. Oh, this is so cool. Yep. Do I know you? It's been a long time. Daz. She made a promise to the one she loved. Dead now. But no less. A promise. Not one soul more would suffer as he had. You should be wearing headphones if you're not. She carries him in her heart. His death, his life, will drive her on. She will forge a purpose from his death. Make meaning from the pain. And then the Northmen came again to our land. Stripping us of our names, our lives, of everything that makes us who we are. Beating and binding, taking us as slaves. These Northmen sail under a blood red side. And one among them they call Master. Senua will follow that sign. She let herself be taken, dragged in chains to their ships, so she can trace the poison to its source, find the heart, and cut it out. Stop this labors. Keep her promise. But plaids can drift off course. Oh shit. Well, that's just not good at all. It begins as it ends. Alone. In the dark. Why wouldn't it, right? It's 
Tell me what to do. This dark land, it pushes back. She's so far from home, from all she's ever known, half drowned, lost in a world still clouded to her eyes, which she won't yield. She must fight on, as she always has. Remember, we've been to hell before. There it is. This is only the beginning. Climb somewhere. You need to climb again. She will fall if she does. She will die. Climb, Sedwa. Climb, climb. She's hurt. So tired. Don't give up. She's going to fall. No. Careful, Senua. We've both been to hell and back. We can handle this, no problem. Draw her onward. The ones who didn't live, the ones she could not save. She can hear them calling. Lives stolen by the Northmen. She carries them with her. Why did we come here? She's stupid! 
Well, we did, so... First of all, I just want to say how absolutely gorgeous this game is. Oh my goodness. It's so good. And I'm just enraptured in what's happening. Go there. Get there. That shit is pathetic. She needs you. <laughs> you didn't do it though. I thought there was someone there. We will. are leading me. They brought me here. She knows that all through this world there are signs and symbols waiting to be discovered. The meaning is there. If only you can find it. What's this over here? A totem? taken you far from home across the boundless sea and you must go on to the heart of this place to the heart of man you have seen how the northmen journey out to conquer and this is one of their lands as icy dark as Niflheim yet as fiery as Muspel Iceland it has eh? long been claimed and they try still that 
shape. And in slow, follow him, but be careful. They will kill you this time. Like they did to her. On the cliff. You were too weak to help. Follow him. Be ready to fight. She is a warrior. A warrior with no sword. No weapon. She came here with nothing. What good are you to anyone with no weapon? He will kill you. He will. This is intense. Seeing if there's anything around here. Oh, look how good this game is. Village. Remember why we came here. She came here for a reason. And now she doesn't know what to do. You don't know where you're going. Your plan is in pieces. She is lost. You're lost. The enslaver, the master, is gone. I have to help you them. Thought you could stop this. But you have lost your mark. The sea tore him away, just like your hopes. You don't need to listen to him. You know this now. Listen to us. You know better. Find the survivor. He is trying to trick you. We need to help the survivors. Save them. Yes, I do. Already dead. The lost one. Don't listen to him. Listen to us, listen not to him. Listen to him. You're a liar. No help in them. Find a way out. Get to the sea. Find your way back to the sea. That is where they need your help. But you can never escape. She will never escape. We you get have out to find a way out of here. You are lost too. She must find a way out. How can the lost? Find anyone. Listen, listen. You bail them. Don't listen to him. They are dead, like your mother. Hey, shut up! Like Make him him shut up. up! Stop it! Can't 
Can't you hear them, Senua? Can't you hear their screams? I can hear them. What's happening? You know they're suffering. They are suffering. But I set them free. Simple. You need to find it. It's here. Somewhere. Look for it. Look for the sign. Find the right perspective. You'll sense when you are close. The signs are here. Do you know where to look? She doesn't. She doesn't. <laughs> I think it's right here. It's there. Focus. You found don't it. Found know it. Focus. How deep it's this it. darkness goes. Yes, you've done it. You completed the symbol. What now? You must go back to the gate. She must go back. Behind the symbol is the source of the darkness. You need to understand it. Uncover the darkness, Emma. This is why you have come. Well, yeah. Some of them, they survived. They tried to, tried to, they were wounded. They were scared, but alive. You can find them. They need you. Honor them. Help them. Honor. Honor, it's them. Find somewhere to hide. Drop anything? But now there's no loot in this cave. <laughs> the dead surround us. Take that. She has to survive. 
survive. You must. You have to survive for us. You made a promise. What is this place? No. No. You've lost another one. Could you? All of this death because of you. Oh, we're gonna get, we're gonna uh, get all these guys, all these motherfuckers. Hold 
de mes miels Come on, who's next? Sword, girl. He looks ready for you. He is ready to fight. You're ready. We will end this. You're oh. fucking dead. Ah. Oh. I think I'd kill you if I wanted to. 
She knew the path would open to her. A blood-carved stave, a salt sea falling, a too familiar darkness, an endless night. He is the next sign. sign. What is it? You need to understand. You need to understand. Answer! It is my father, Sigil. His father. Your father. Huh? The Gothi. Monster. He's here. <laughs> Look at him. No. But this place is his. The people here are weak. They would not survive without his help. <laughs> oh. Like you. Does she? Enough! He's wounded. He won't try anything. You have to keep your eyes on. Well, I think we're going to end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you like this content. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye bye.